When you bite into it, you have the crispiness of the fish, you have the acidity from the cabbage, you have the spiciness and the aromatic flavors of the peanuts and also the chili. Sort of taking that uh, and did a classic dish that I really enjoy. So my name is Vicky Chang, I'm the chef uh, owner of Bear Restaurant. So the philosophy is Chinese ex French. It's actually a combination of using Chinese and French technique. So I wanted to make you a dish that was inspired by my recent trip to Beijing. It's called uh, Sun Chao Yu in Chinese. It literally translates to sour cabbage fish. Uh, so I went to Beijing and wherever I was, I found packages and packages of Sun Chao. Uh, my wife was with me in Beijing uh, and my, my wife loves sour things. She would literally peel a lemon and eat it like orange. As I was there, for every restaurant we went to, uh, we were always ordering the same Sun Chao Yu. Uh, and as I came back, the only thing that my wife brought back uh, was, no joke, 50 packs of this Sun Choi in a luggage. So I didn't have luggage, I didn't have space for anything else anymore. It was just like full of cabbage. Uh, we love using local seafood here in Bea, uh, wherever we can. Uh, we try to use local fish, uh, local seafood. Uh, tonight I will be using local silver palm fried. We've taken a technique that I've grew, I grew up uh, learning how to cook fish by pan frying super crispy on the skin, by pairing with a sauce that is quite traditionally Chinese, uh, by including the heads and the bones of the fish, which is essentially the most flavorful part of the fish. When you bite into it, you have the crispiness of the fish, you have the acidity from the, from the cabbage, you have the spiciness and the aromatic flavors of the peanuts and also the chili. I sort of taken that uh, and did a classic dish that I really enjoy. A lot of my inspiration comes from raw ingredients, like I mentioned, uh, locally as well. Uh, so I go to the market every day. Whether I need to buy something or not, I generally always end up buying something because uh, there's always something new. It is really important as a chef to, to see what we have locally. The truth of the matter is Hong Kong is spe such a special city. You can get anything imported to Hong Kong as long as you're willing to pay for it. But you start to neglect what's already here. And whenever it is from Hong Kong, I'm more proud to serve it. And this is, this is really true from, for, for every, every item that we serve here.